obviously this crisis has been terrible uh, and has affected so many people, has affected, has taken a lot of people's lives. Um, but I think there's uh, valuable lessons to be learned from this crisis. You know, it 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 showed us that we were not prepared. Uh, we are not prepared. It showed us how uh, vulnerable we are as human beings. How vulnerable our you know foundations are. How weak our our economy and how not prepared our healthcare system is. Um, you know, and I think this is the last time we've seen a a pandemic, a virus, a disease like this. And in the future, I hope that we're gonna be um, using this this crisis, this COVID nineteen, as an example. And I hope that we're gonna learn from it and prepare for for the future. Um, because as I said, I doubt this is the last time. Um, so yeah, this is obviously it's been hard. Obviously, it has affected so many people's lives, taking lives. But there's a lessons to be learned from it, definitely. I think there's three steps uh, that could be taken. Um, one of them is from the government side. Uh, you know, government should use more resources, more energy, and include scientists, doctors in part of when it comes to taking decisions. Um, because at the end, this COVID-19 crisis showed that they are extremely important and they are the ones who are going to save lives at the end. And then having the right funds for the scientists or enough funds for the scientists and healthcare system is going to be crucial in the future. Secondly, I think we have to have a plan. Um, plan is because this is definitely not the last time we're going to be seeing a pandemic or an outbreak and we should have a plan because when you have a plan you know what you're going to be doing and 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 in this kind of pandemic or outbreak time is really crucial so if you have a plan how to react what to do how to stop the spread um i think you're going to be able to to control the outbreak faster and thereby obviously saving more lives and third um, you know it'll be nice to have a bit more transparency during uh, between in between countries where tr information uh, can travel faster again just because to save the time because time is crucial and this crisis has been a perfect example for it um, so yeah I hope these step three steps um, or <laughs> being considered right now and I hope that they are gonna implant them in the future.